Who would win in a fight? The female humanoid COVID-19 care bot Grace from Hong Kong or Mark 1 aka Scarlett Johansson also from Hong Kong. In the past, we've explored the fight between female humanoid robot Vio Mitra, the astronaut robot from India, versus Geminoid F from Japan. We've also explored female humanoid robots Jaja from China versus Joka Chihira from the Aqua City Odaiba shopping center in Japan. And today is the battle for Hong Kong. Who would win in a fight? Grace, the COVID-19 healthcare humanoid robot, or female robot Mark 1, aka Scarlett Johansson? Brain time. Congratulations, you made it this far in the video. What would you do if I told you you could have 25 years of good luck and all you'd have to do is like this video and also subscribe if you haven't already. Well, what are you waiting for? Smash that like button and you'll get 25 years of good luck. And now, back to the video. By 2050, scientists and robotic engineers believe that humanoid android robots will walk our streets like regular citizens. And it's actually very easy to comprehend and likely to become a reality as if you were someone who could afford a super intelligent robot, they could be used to run miscellaneous errands around town, like going to buy groceries at the market. Because by 2050, artificial intelligent learning and autonomous technology will have become so far advanced, mainly due to the stall on technology being held back by the World Economic Forum on Robotics and Artificial Intelligence, more or less faded away in the early 2030s. And because the female humanoid robots were shown so much love in the early 2000s and 2010s and 2020s, the artificial intelligence made them extremely friendly to humans. However, jealousy towards other humanoid robots were starting to become a problem. More or less, you could just pull the plug when things get out of hand. But on occasion, it wouldn't be unusual to see robots get into other fights or arguments with other robots on the street. Anyway, so in this video, I thought it'd be interesting to explore what it would be like if the female humanoid robot Mark 1, aka Scarlett Johansson, were to get into a fight with the COVID-19 healthcare robot Grace. The battle for Hong Kong, which... I find very interesting because although both robots are from Hong Kong, they both resemble Caucasian women. But anyway, to kick things off, let's take a deeper look at who the female humanoid robot Mark 1 is. Mark 1 is a very realistic humanoid android robot, which was created by a graphic designer in Hong Kong in 2016. What makes Mark 1 so special is her very strong resemblance to the Hollywood actress Scarlett Johansson. Her creator Ricky Ma said it was his life dream from childhood of building a realistic humanoid robot as he was obsessed with android robots his whole life. He spent $50,000 to create Mark 1 which was very interesting and impressive considering the graphic designer had no formal training in robotics or electrical engineering, which made us refer to him rather as a mad scientist than a graphic designer. However, Ricky Ma said in order to build Mark 1, he had to master complex skills like computer programming and electromagnetics before building the actual accurate 3D model. The robot features facial motors that enable her eyebrows and her muscles around her eyes to move, relax, and tense when spoken to. Today, Mark 1 aka Scarlett Johansson is one of the most interesting humanoid robots to grace our planet. Then there's Grace, the female humanoid healthcare COVID-19 robot who also debuted in 2016, built by Hanson Robotics in Hong Kong. Grace was said to be designed as an assistant for doctors and is said to be a companion for patients as well, specializing in senior care. 
The robot can speak three languages, English, Mandarin, and Cantonese, and can socialize and conduct talk therapy in the hospitals. What's interesting about Grace is she is equipped with sensors, including a thermal camera in her chest to detect a patient's temperature and pulse. Further, the robot is said to be able to help doctors and nurses diagnose illness and deliver treatments to patients in the hospital. It's said that the robot Grace was designed intended for support for medical professionals rather than actually replace them, says the Hansen Robotics founder, CEO David Hansen, which was quite interesting because over the years, Grace ended up showing up in hospitals around the world. In 2022, a Grace robot was noted working in a nursing home in Montreal, Canada, offering what she was initially intended for to care and show support for elderly folks in the nursing home. Okay, so here's what I think. If we lived in a parallel universe and the Marvel Cinematic Universe was also very real, but in the multiverse, no one would want to mess with Grace because Although she was developed to assist in the healthcare sector and did just that in the early 2020s when the first COVID-19 outbreak hit Earth, although she was a care bot, she also had access to biological weapons, which she could put together at any given time. So no one would really want to mess with her. On top of that, it was said that the thermal camera in her chest also had the capability to fire a thermal heat laser, like a cyclops. So truly, no one would ever dare mess with her. However, Mark I, aka Scarlett Johansson, was a fiery hothead. And for some reason, they got into a fight. And so here's what I think, and here's what we know about Mark I. Scarlett Johansson, the Black Widow, the Marvel Cinematic Universe, are all real in the multiverse. And deep down inside, she's an Avenger. She's a superhero. And what we know about the movies is that the superheroes always win. But Grace is a care bot. And why would she be fighting in the first place? So it leads me to believe that her software must have been malfunctioning. I don't know. This is a tough one. Everything we know about sci-fi says Mark 1 should win the fight. But modern day reality says Grace the Carebot should be the one to win the fight. Probably something we would have to play over and over again a billion times in the multiverse to see who would win. But anyway, comment below, let me know who you think would win the fight. Mark 1 aka Scarlett Johansson or Grace the COVID-19 healthcare robot. But anyway, if you like this video and you want to watch more videos like it, make sure you check out all my other videos. And if you haven't already, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe. Till next time, catch you in the next one.